Guys, there's a level three white tail right there. That's our first potential diamond from level four. Guys, you are not gonna believe this. Another level three white tail. I am still at level four. We just had a warning call from some white tail. So I'm sneaking in because I need to kill some. Hey guys, we're back here on the hunter call of the wild. And today we're gonna be doing episode two of our beginner playthrough series. Right now I am at level four. We're gonna be leveling all the way up to level 60. And we're gonna be trying to find as many trophies as possible as we level up. So the other thing we're gonna be doing is not using any DLC until level 30. So that is going to be very challenging. Where are you, Whitetail? I must have already spooked him. Man! Well, welcome to the life of a brand new player. We are very loud with no skills and perks. Oh, there we go. I found a Whitetail. Okay. You know what? Maybe I could shoot him with the shotgun. Just gotta get really nice and close. So currently, this is my loadout. I have the 270. I have the 243 with soft points only so far. I have to unlock the polymers. I do have the Sunberg 454 handgun with no scope. You have to unlock that. And then I do have the Caversham Stewart 12 gauge shotgun, no scope. And we only have buckshot. I have to unlock birdshot in order to be able to shoot anything that is class one. So if I can sneak up to this guy, guy and take him with the shotgun with no scope that would get us a little bit of shotgun score but guys let me know in the comments what level you currently are in game and what your favorite thing is to hunt so far and somewhere in the video i am going to share a key phrase drop that in the comments for your chance to win a one month membership to the channel and we are getting really close to that white tail holy there we go two shots that's all we get uh-oh and he went splat! First animal down with the shotgun. Okay. Oh, that's pretty great. We got a vital. We got full score with the Caversham 12 gauge on this whitetail 220.37. That is pretty sweet. So that was a 12.12 meter shot. I will take that. So $670. I want to know how much. 202 XP. Wow, well, we're definitely gonna be doing that again. So I wanna do a little bit of elk and moose hunting today. Gonna work my way up here and check for more whitetail. I wanna see if there's a level three whitetail on my map. I'm gonna check all my whitetail zones. We're gonna be grinding for cash today and unlocking as much as we possibly can. Oh my gosh, there's a bear. Hello, hello. I doubt I hit it. I'm looking for it to come out the other side. Where did it go? No hunting pressure. <laughs> it just vanished. Oh my gosh. No bear for me. Where the heck? Oh, there he is. Oh, I can see that it's a level six. That's one point in spotting knowledge. Very sweet. I didn't realize I had that already. Guys, there's a level three white tail right there. I just shot a white tail out of this zone just for some cash. And there's a level three. Looks nice and wide. I hope it's not a troll. I'm at level four. Okay, I need him to come back. I'm actually gonna work my way around to get the, uh, there's an outpost around here somewhere, but I need to get that level three. <laughs> I'm gonna follow them. Now I'm probably making a lot of noise. <laughs> okay guys, just for a little bit of humor, I decided to take my four wheeler and come out here to unlock this lookout tower because the level three whitetail is way up here. I hunted my way up here and then we crashed. And I need to make my way back up there and I decided to unlock the lookout tower and I'm very bad at driving a four wheeler. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna, oh, it's gonna burst into flames any minute. But basically when you're unlocking things that are on a mountain, you need to find the dotted line because getting up a mountain without being on a road is next to impossible. It will be very frustrating. So I'm making my way over to this road and then I'm gonna make my way up and unlock the lookout tower. Oh, watch out, there's a tree right in front of you. Uh-oh, we're polluting the environment. This is bad. Okay, we made it to the road. Hold on, hold on. I need to discover this need zone. White tail. Feet zone. Look at that. I can't believe we made it. Oh, hit that last tree. That's bad. I can't believe we made it. It's a small miracle. Look how beautiful it is from up here. And it's foggy today. Could be even nicer. But I do have the sound turned off, the music. 
But look at that, we just got 100 XP just for unlocking the lookout tower. So that is our next destination. And we're definitely not gonna make it without exploding the four-wheeler, so let's see how far we get. Well, I think the only way out is the same way we came in, otherwise I am gonna fall off a cliff and die and have to make my way all the way back here. So, we're back on the four-wheeler. Okay. Oh no, oh no, oh no! I made it! Bang! Oh! All right, might as well discover that. Do I get XP for that? Oh, I do! So unlock it all, guys. Unlock it all. And it's on fire. That's it for us. Rest in peace, my dude. Okay, guys, there is our level three whitetail. Back in his zone after we spooked him. Coming for you. I'm coming for you, my dude. I am very excited because I can't see him. Oh, he's giving us a beautiful broadside. I'm going to take it from about 200 meters. This is crazy. I've actually gotten pretty lucky with the whitetail. A couple years ago, while I was making my last beginner guide, I shot a diamond whitetail from level three. This time we're doing it from level four. Okay, I'm going to introduce him to my 270. Here we go. Oh, this is terrifying. All right, I'm gonna get as close as I can. Yes, now we're perfectly zeroed. Please die. Did he die? He died! We got him! Yes! Okay, still has to make diamond. He could be a troll. Please do not troll me. And there's the vital blood splatter. Yes! Okay, now where did he go? There he is. Okay, I'm saying a little prayer right now. <laughs> you can do it, my dude! You can do it! Is he a diamond? No! No! Oh, are you kidding? I am broken hearted. First troll at level four. <laughs> Well, at least we didn't mess it up. Actually, it was a beautiful shot. 157 meters. First level three is not big enough. Well, I guess I'll take a photo of that. That is very, very heartbreaking. This is where we are at the top of the swamplands. Well, I'm gonna keep looking. We're gonna work our way this way. Let's do it. Look at this, guys. We found a shed. Isn't that cool? I will take it. Hey. I don't think anything happens to them when you collect them. It's not like you get to keep them or anything. Would be cool if we could put them in the lodge though. That would be sweet. Look at this guys. I just unlocked this lookout tower and have a bunch of whitetail passing by. I know they can smell me. Guess I'm gonna have to stand. Let's see. 105 meters. Oh, that's beautiful. Stay right there. I so miss watching the health drop. All right, I need to reload. Did he not die? That looked like a good shot to me. No? Really? <laughs> okay, maybe not. But you know what? It is now moose time, so we are gonna hunt moose now. And hopefully we'll make more cash because moose definitely pay more than whitetail do. Uh, no, no, no dead whitetail. Wow, that is unfortunate. I'm just gonna check what kind of shot we did get. I think once we get our hands on the polymers, things are gonna go a lot smoother. No organs hit. A uh, swing and a miss for me. Oh, well. Well, better luck next time. Let's go find some moose. Hopefully that are broadside to shoot with the 270. Oh, hold on here. Hold on. Well, let's shoot a doe then. 97 meters. Okay, we have to aim low because we're automatically zeroed to 150. Oh, you're the best. Splat! Just took a willy-nilly shot in there, you never know. But, oh! Our other buck did die, but I don't think I'm gonna track it. Beautiful left lung and liver shot. That was absolutely perfect. $579 for me. Did I actually kill two things here? I did. I took that blind shot over here. And there's a body. We got a vital. That is crazy. Get the heck out. Oh! Upper neck? I totally meant to do that, but not really. But I'll take the $713. Not bad at all. That's kind of hilarious. <laughs> I just figured, oh, there's a whole bunch of whitetail running around. Let's take a shot. You just never know. And actually got a vital. That's crazy. All right. We are going to work our way up this way. We're going to unlock the outpost over here. Should be about right there, I think. I've decided not to get friends to unlock my map. I'm going to hunt through and unlock the whole thing myself. All of them. Because that's what I used to do back in the day. And we're talking almost seven years ago that I was a 
brand new player for the very first time. It's really crazy to think about. If you guys didn't know how I started playing this game, I went into an EB game store, which is now called GameStop, in the mall with my son, who was 12 at the time, and the Hunter Call of the Wild was in the Xbox case on the end unit, and I think it had just come out on console, and I picked it up, and I said to my son, this looks cool, you wanna try it? He said, sure, why not? We didn't look it up, we just bought it and walked out, and little did I know how that would change my life one day, and it really did. If it weren't for that day, I would not be here right now. So that's pretty crazy. Oh my gosh, that is a beautiful moose. I really don't want him to get away. Where are you going, my buddy? Well, I tried. Don't know if I even hit him, but I have to stop to reload. So annoying. <laughs> I can't wait till I don't have to stop to reload. The things we take for granted. Well, he did not die. Oh well, I had to try. Okay guys, we have a moose. It is drinking and sitting pretty for us, so we're gonna try and take it down with the 270. Or should I sneak in and try and use the Rhino? I need to purchase and unlock the Hyperion. We'll just use the 270 for right now, and the next one we will use, or try to use, the Rhino. I wonder how far he's gonna run with a shot from the 270. We're about to find out. I need to buy more ammo. Okay, here we go. Right behind the shoulder blade. No breath left. Look at my poor heart exploding. Holy. Calm down. Easy. Ten minutes later, <laughs> we're allowed to shoot again. Okay. Ah, uh, that's stinking grass. Okay. I took it. Of course, I can't see his health dropping, but I'm just gonna watch him as long as I possibly can. That had to be a good shot. Maybe I'll put another shot into him. I think I hit him again. Either way, it should lessen the tracking time. Dude, are you gonna die? Hurry up and die. I think we might be doing a lot of tracking. Our moose still has not died, which is crazy. And I'm wondering if it's because I'm using soft points that maybe, I mean, it had to be a good shot as far as where I aimed, but I'm thinking maybe the soft points just didn't penetrate and it gave me a flush shot. In which case, he is probably not going to die. He still hasn't died. <laughs> I think this is a lost cause. Yeah, there's really no point tracking him. Well, next time we will use the rhino because this will not happen. Okay, we found a zone full of moose, but this time I'm gonna sneak in really nice and close and I'm gonna try and use the rhino. Now I don't have a scope for it, but it's just gonna work so much better than the 270. So we're gonna make our best attempt. Here we go. Now, if you're wondering where moose drink, here is my hotspot map for moose and moose drink on all maps that have moose. Their universal drink time is from 12 till 1600. So we're getting really nice and close now. 86 meters away. Guys, if you are enjoying the video so far, please take a second and splat that like button. Thank you guys so much. Okay, so now I am hidden under a tree. Of course, I can't see anything, but they are just around the corner here. I just can't see them. I'm gonna try and stay hidden. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I think we're pretty darn close. This is beautiful. Look, we are perfectly hidden. Okay. Now I would imagine without zeroing, we are zeroed to the middle distance and that would be 50 meters, which is how far we are away from them. I think this guy knows I'm here. Dude. <laughs> not doing so well. Come on, reload. No, don't run. It's not so easy without a scope. All right, you know what? I might need the 270 to finish the job. Did anybody die? No! <laughs> This is not so easy. Oh my gosh, that's embarrassing. It is not easy being a new player. Oh, that's just terrible. That's crazy. I'm not doing so great, am I? Okay, so I'm gonna drop a tent, if I can, just to change the time, because it's cheaper to do in a tent. It's 25% cheaper to change the time in a tent than it is in an outpost. And when you're a new player and you're super duper broke, there we go, that's gonna make a difference. Now I can't afford to buy tents, but the tent DLC comes with four free tents, one of each variation, so blacktail. I think we should stick to blacktail and smaller creatures and not worry so much about moose until we get our hands on the seven millimeter. So blacktail drink from 16 to 20, that'll do. Okay, and then I'm just gonna pick this back up. Now blacktail drink on the right half of the map, we have mainly been sticking to the whitetail area, so now we wanna go to all these little lakes 
and the East Coast. And that is gonna be not the easiest, but I know that's an outpost. So let's hunt our way over here and open that outpost. Now, when you're running around the map, guys, you do want to pick up all of these landmarks because they will give you XP, says lore unlocked, added to the codex, and that gave us 100 XP. Hey, I will take it. Pass them by anyway. Ooh, I just spooked elk. That's our first elk. Ugh. Oh, I need to buy more ammo. No way I'm hitting that. Okay, so I just unlocked this outpost right here, and I know that there's almost always blacktail drinking on this lake here, but here is my blacktail hotspot map. Not only will this show you where you'll find blacktail deer, but you can actually see where all the outposts and lookout towers are. So use that to help unlock your map. Now there's a bunch of female Roosevelt elk out here. Let's shoot one. That had to be a good shot. It just had to be. Oh my gosh, I miss my 300 so much. Okay, she went down. Phew, and we did get a vital. Perfect. How you doing, little lady? $556, not the greatest. Man, when you shoot a hind red deer, they pay $1,000. These pay half of that. What is up with that? Look at this, guys. The 270 polymers have unlocked. Okay, $700, ouch. But we need them. So I am going to buy 30 of them and that's going to make a huge difference. So can't forget to move them over. I'm gonna take the soft points out. We won't be using those anymore. Now let me look again. And the 243 polymers, I know the 243 soft points are free, but you want the polymers. So I'm gonna buy 30 of those as well and Move those over. So let's load those in and we're gonna be doing way better now. Now let's also load out the 243 in case, oops, in case we find a sweet coyote. No, no soft points. Now we'll be able to make some serious cash because I need to purchase the Hyperion very much. Very, very much. Oh, oh dear. Now I can't carry tents. Ugh. Okay. All right, I'm not gonna take the 243 right now. I'd rather carry a tent. If I really, really need it, if I run into a nine legendary coyote, I will drop a tent and grab the 243. Now I know from personal experience that this lake right here is usually loaded with blacktail. There's usually multiple drink zones. So I'm gonna tippy toe my way in because I need to make some serious cash. And now we have the polymers. There we go. We have a level four already. Beautiful. There could be blacktail closer to us, so I'm still gonna tippy toe in. Do I really only have one zone of blacktail here? Well, that'll do. And there's another zone. Okay. So what we wanna do is spot every single one, make sure there isn't a level five in there. Okay, beautiful. That is a lot of blacktail. Okay, we're gonna shoot as many as we possibly can. Now they are 122 meters, but with this scope, it's so terrible. <laughs> so bad. The starter scope is so bad, but I'm gonna lay down so they don't start to see me because we're getting pretty close. Okay, here we go. All right, we're gonna start with you, my dude. I hit two pretty good. Oh, one is already down. That is so sweet. Okay, and I'm sure these guys are gone. They are. And we have double hunting pressure. Man, polymers rule. Okay, here is our first one. $948, that is very sweet. All right, we got a beautiful vital shot with the polymers from 94 meters. Awesome. And we got two. Okay, here is our second black tail. Another $968 and another beautiful shot. That is awesome. Okay, and we are up at the top of the lookout tower. Let's have a look at the pan out. And we leveled up. Look how beautiful that is. Layton really is a beautiful map. Okay, we have a skill point. Absolutely sweet. I'm going to continue with spotting knowledge. So I'm gonna put my second point in there. So this is going to reveal info about the approximate health of the animal. So now we will be able to see if it is dropping in health and that will tell us whether we got a good shot or not. So that is awesome. And now we can see where the outpost is. Let's go get it. Okay, we are now at Mushroom Lake right there. And we have a really nice big herd of blacktail. And this guy has a really funky rack. Look at that. That's super cool. All right, we're gonna try and take him down. Three zones of blacktail on this lake. Okay, here we go. Hopefully we can take more than one. Man, I wish I could zoom in more. Don't know how we did, let's go find out. We have hunting pressure, yes. 
my heart is just exploding at all times. It's so hard to keep a steady shot. Well, I think we got two there. This guy is fleeing. Okay, I'll shoot him too. No problem with that. Okay, hopefully that was good. And it was. Beautiful. We're gonna have that Hyperion very soon. We need 12,000. There is the dough, $822 with a nice vital shot. Not bad for a dough. And our buck with the funky rack is not a bad one. 161.1, $1, $1115. And that is a pretty cool rack. I like it. Now that is the definition of true rack. And we got a beauty shot. The soft points would not have broken through the scapula there. I don't think so. And we have one more to pick up and that should give us enough to buy the Hyperion. Yes. Oh, there's some elk. That was, it's, What's killing me is my inability to keep the scope steady. I just can't do it. But we got another one here, $1,042, and we have $12,000. We're going shopping. This is going to make the hugest difference. I'm gonna have no money, but I think we have enough ammo to get through for now. So let's go to rifle sights. And there it is, the Hyperion. Yes! I am so happy. Move that baby over and get rid of that one. Throw that on the 270 and now, oh yes. But I saved the very best for last in today's video. We found another level three whitetail. At level four, this is what happened. Guys, you are not gonna believe this. Another level three whitetail. I am still at level four. <laughs> This one's gonna make it, I hope. So now we're on the riverway. I have been working my way up here, hoping we would find one of these, and we did. Here is the Stradivarius, the 270. Not sure how to cross the river, but I will figure it out. Okay, there he is. He is just sitting so perfect for us. Okay. Looked beauty. He didn't drop yet, but he is down. We got him. Yes. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, I think I'm gonna run around the corner down here. I don't see the vital blood splatter. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, that's beautiful. It's gonna be back here. There he is. How you doing, my floating dude? Oh, you look very nice. <laughs> I can't believe this. Level four. Here we go. Yes. First diamond at level four, baby. 261.78 diamond whitetail. And we are definitely, oh, hold on here. Maybe I shouldn't taxi it. I think I'll save it. I'm gonna save it for now. I will taxi it. I just don't have a lot of money right now. And I don't think that's probably the best use of my cash. I really need the Hyperion. So we're gonna continue to grind for cash. But now we do have our first diamond at level four. So I am pretty darn elated. Let's take a photo of that. And let me show you where we are on the map. There's the shot. Oh man, it was a little too far back. But man, it's not easy to see through that scope. A little too far back, but it was a good shot and we leveled up. Okay, so let's have a look. We have a perk point. What should we do with it? I want all of these. The question is, which one do I want first? I'll end up with weapon zeroing. I think we're gonna go with steady hands. Decreased wobble, win in aim mode using any weapon, each level unlocked increases the effect. So that's what we did. Okay, we have found, oh no, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. We found some Roosevelt elk. Yes, we have not shot one yet. And now I have the Hyperion and I do have the polymers. Now they are class eight. So they're right at the top of what we're able to shoot with the 270. So our next big goal is to purchase the seven millimeter and that is a really nice elk. Unfortunately, that little lip is blocking them. I can't shoot them there. We're gonna have to sneak up to them. They're nervous. Why are you nervous? Okay guys, I have snuck all the way in to almost 50 meters. It is now dark. Okay, I'm gonna hide right here under this tree. Got a black-tailed doe right here. It's her lucky day because we are after the elk. Now I think that's his rear end facing me. Both of them, but not this one. Okay, and now we have the Hyperion, but I still can't spot them. No, he has his rear end to me too. That is so <laughs> unfortunate. Okay, you know what? I just need to make them aware that I'm here and they'll start moving around. Get up, get up. Okay, there we go, there we go. He's alert. Okay, oh, the scope is so great. That's the best I'm gonna get. Okay, 
probably only gonna get one just because I can't see them. Splat. Oh. I'm just gonna keep shooting. Well, hopefully we got the first one, if nothing else. And we did, yes. Oh, we got a vital here. Look at that. Okay, and a non-vital on the same one. I still run pretty far with the 270. Oh, here he is. Beautiful. How you doing, my buddy? You are a beauty. Yes. I didn't, I put too many shots into him. So we only got $789, but he is a nice one. 329. First shot was not a vital. Oh, he was on the run. Second shot was beautiful. And unfortunately we did put a third shot in. That's okay. Better safe than sorry. He's not a diamond. Next video, we're headed to Hirschfelden to hunt for trophy red deer and try and level up to unlock more gear. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, click right here for the top 10 tips and tricks for new players.